Hello everyone, welcome back to Aaron's Scrub. Today we're going over what is a subconjunctival hemorrhage, or an SCH for short. No, it isn't caused by the evil eye, although this looked kind of gnarly. This is day one of the SCH that I acquired. Now don't fret, this is essentially a tiny blood vessel burst right under the surface of your conjunctiva, and because it is in the sclera, or the white portion of your eye, it looks crazier than it really is. This can easily be caused by the following. A strong sneeze, strong cough, straining, vomiting, or irritation such as rubbing your eye like I did here, or a foreign object. The cause for concern is usually harmless, except if you experience any of the following, such as dizziness, numbness, loss of vision, or a headache, call your provider. It normally goes away within 7 to 14 days, but depends on how severe it is. Treatment includes any of the following. Ice, cold dampened washcloth, if you don't have ice. As with anything that you put to your face, make sure that the product is clean before applying it. Try to stay clear of anything that may be potentially irritating to the eye, such as makeup. Sorry, but give it a rest for now. You can use eye drops such as bromenadine tartrate, but be wary of other eye drops such as visine, which can cause more dryness. And lastly, you want to avoid any strenuous activities that can cause any strain, such as using a booty band, using weights. You can go ahead and opt out for walking or cycling instead. Similar to a bruise, when your eye starts to heal, it's going to start to turn different colors such as this yellow right here. Also, since we are working with gravity, the blood may travel downward more towards your iris, so don't be alarmed if the redness starts to fall a little bit more. It took 32 days for my eye to heal, but it's okay. Everyone heals differently. Thanks so much for watching. Comment, like, subscribe.